Let me tell you what I don't like about Dutch people, okay? Oh. <laughs> it tastes amazing, I'll tell you right now. <laughs> bit of a different video than usual as you can see because on the one hand I've got my now husband this is Robin he's representing from the Netherlands and then I've got my sister who's representing from Canada she's come all the way over to the Netherlands to visit us and they both want to make something for you what are we I'm making gonna show Sam how you make proper ramen <laughs> so a month ago Sadie called me and said Robin makes the best ramen and I was like you're telling a Vancouverite that someone from the Netherlands makes the best ramen no we're having a cook okay so the we'll trash talking has already begun we're about to make ramen let's see who makes it the best Let's get started. Okay, so first we're gonna make our paste or our sauce. In a small bowl, we're gonna mix bean paste, miso paste, Asian sesame paste, and almond milk. So sometimes I don't have sesame paste at home, so I use almond butter, peanut butter, whatever butter I have. And now I'm gonna cut up some veggies. Okay. You, gotta, you gotta tuck your fingers, sister. Which one? Let me do my way. Now I'm all nervous. <laughs> I don't know how to cut onions. <laughs> I absolutely love mushrooms in my ramen. The more, the better. And you're gonna love my ramen. <laughs> I don't think so. Robin, have you had ramen in Vancouver yet? I did. It was disgusting. What? Can we cut out that part? He's gonna get a lot of. Uh, you're gonna. You're honestly gonna get canceled. If he's <laughs> I feel like he was trying to trash talk you, and then he just like trash talked the nation. Of Vancouver. Yeah. <laughs> But you know what? Let's keep it in there. I can't wait to hear people's comments. <laughs> How do you like it so far? How do you like it so far? Are you learning a lot? <laughs> okay, so everything looks fantastic. Um, next step is you want to add the miso mixture. Robin, make sure you're taking note. And you want to add the stock. And you want to let it simmer for about 10 minutes. Why is he taking note? Child's place. <laughs> you want to try some? That's really good. Drop it's it a bit spicy, I will say that. So if anyone doesn't like too much heat, you can drop down the amount of um, the well, bean the, paste. Yeah, the bean paste comes in different versions. You can get a spicy version or you can get a mild version. This one was spicy. And maybe say something about like, I like the thicker, chewier noodles, but you can do like the skinny, curly ones. No, I want to say what I feel like. Okay, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so now we're gonna boil the noodles. Um, and it could take anywhere between 30 seconds to two minutes. All depends on the kind of noodles that you have. Is that okay? That's good. Yeah. Should I say something else? <laughs> That's, good. That's good. No, go! I'll do another one. You're so annoying. I didn't do anything. Why are you laughing? Why was that so funny? Because you're cute. I love you. No, that means you didn't like it. Go I back. Love it. These are noodles. These are the ramen noodles. And we're gonna put it in for about 30 seconds to a couple minutes. It all depends on what kind of noodles you have. There's thin noodles, there's curly noodles, there's thick noodles. Choose what noodles you like. We're going for the thicker ones. Thank you, that's a lot better. It was a lot better, but we're definitely both divas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so while the noodles are cooking, we're just gonna add a couple final things to our water mixture. Is that right? <laughs> to our to ramen? Our oh yeah, 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 okay. So we got a bok choy here, and we got um, this little puff fried tofu. I love these things. It's really fun, but I mean, you can use any tofu you have. It smells amazing. Robin, what do you think? It looks good, but we're going to have to see if it tastes good too. It though. tastes amazing, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> so I've got the chili oil here for the topping. Awesome. So now we can garnish the ramen. Honestly, there's like 101 different ways that you can garnish ramen. But I love little carrot sticks, green onions, and some sprouts. And I got some black sesame here as well. You are about to taste the best ramen you have ever had in your entire life. And I'm gonna watch you. I'm gonna watch you close. <laughs> Let me tell you what I don't like about Dutch people, okay? <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. I'm, I still have to taste Last the ramen. Last time he was in Vancouver, I was like, you gotta try the best sushi I've ever had in your life. He had some and I'm like, did you love it? And he looked at me, he's like, y'all, it's good. I'm like, what do you mean? Did you die? Do you wanna bring you a coffin? You wanna call the florist for some white roses? He's like, y'all, it's good. And I'm like, Sadie, he didn't like it. She's like, he loved it. Best Dutch people, they can sometimes be subdued in their responses. It's, good. it's, good. it's all right, it's yeah, good. It's all right, it's okay. You just said a minute ago it's amazing. No, it's really good, it's really good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right? Stop this is gonna be hard. So so keep going, keep going, go, 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 go. <laughs> 
All right, next. It's not gonna be as fun. All right, so yours was a miso ramen. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make a shoyu ramen. Oh, you're gonna show me. Yes. Show me. <laughs> Soy sauce based ramen. I'm gonna start with cutting some of these mushrooms up. Fry this in two equal pieces. Okay, I'm gonna go to the stove now. Just gonna add a little bit of sesame oil to this pan and heat it up. I saw that you used vegetable oil. That's a rookie mistake. You always gotta use sesame oil. What? I wasn't using any sort of... You did. You used vegetable oil. I love vegetable oil. <laughs> Through the game in the first half. <laughs> that can't be on camera, I'll tell you that right now. Now I'm gonna add some grated ginger, some garlic. Make sure you use a lot, you need the flavor. The mushrooms, the bean paste, soy sauce. I'm gonna add water. And now I'm gonna add my secret ingredients, not my secret ingredients, a very common ingredient, it's called kombu, it's seaweed. And we're just gonna let that sit in the broth, put the lid on. I don't want too much water to evaporate. I think I got it. You forgot the bouillon cube though. Oh no, sh <laughs> So I'm using a bouillon cube, you could also use vegetable stock, of course. Now we're going to make the warm topping, so I'm gonna fry up some baby corn. Oh, look at that little wedding band though on his finger, look at that. Oh, yo, yo, yo. This is very simple. We're just gonna fry these up in a little bit of vegetable oil and add a little bit of salt. Did he just say vegetable oil? Oh. Sesame oil. No, actually I'm gonna use sesame oil. So these are good now. I'm gonna remove them from the heat and actually use the same pan for the shiitake mushrooms. His is a little bit more complicated than yours, hey Song? I think I'm gonna take a nap. Let me know when it's done. <laughs> So I'm gonna fry these first until they're golden before I add the teriyaki sauce because there's sugar in teriyaki sauce. And if you add it too soon, it's gonna burn it. Now we're gonna make the noodles. We're almost done. I'm gonna finish up this broth with a little bit of vinegar and a little bit of sugar for sweetness. Just a little bit to taste. And then just before I'm gonna serve it, I'm gonna put the bok choy in, stir it around a little bit. For the final, final step, I'm gonna take the kombu out because we don't wanna eat that. Sam, you wanna try? Try and be amazed. I just woke up from my nap. I'm really hungry. I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. That's really good. Yeah, yeah honest? That's fantastic. Nice. Not, not as good as mine, but it's up there. Like mine with, mine's a 10. 9.2. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna add these toppings, these nice fried up baby corn. I'm gonna add a delicious grilled taste to the soup. Next, the teriyaki shiitakes. This is a smoked tofu. It's like very thick. It Tofu that doesn't fall apart. You can play like a baseball match with this. Like a rubber pad. You're not, you're not selling it though. <laughs> but it's very tasty. And you don't have to really prepare it. You can just put it in your broth. All right, I'm gonna let you do the honors. I'm excited. I mean, it looks great. I'm so nervous. <laughs> not just the noodles though. You gotta let it get a little bit. Come here, my Oh my god, but it's so good. It is good. I mean, if you don't have kids in about half an hour to spare, definitely try this one. <laughs> now let's go to, to the judge. Well, regardless of who wins, I think this is already an achievement on its own. That's and, sweet. Right? That's, that's loser talk. <laughs> Okay, well, I already tried Sam, so mm -hmm. I'm just gonna try it again. It's creamier, mm -hmm. it's faster to make. That's a big pro yeah. of yours. Really, really fast. Yeah. That's really good though. All right. That's really good. Oh, that broth is really good. I don't know. I don't know that I thought this through. I don't think I really wanna choose my, <laughs> I'm choosing between my husband and my <laughs> sister. Just remember who raised you and who changed your diapers so and who, who gave you 25 cents so you could have some money for the dollar store. Like, stuff like cents that. Do you remember? You can have 25 cents for me. You can have 50 cents. <laughs> They're both winners. No, you gotta choose. Make your choose between family. I'm gonna be straight up. I love you. She didn't say anything yet. I didn't say anything. <laughs> nothing added I'm, for the words, but. I'm biased towards liking creamy broths. Right. However, this one, the broth is amazing, okay. and the teriyaki shiitakes are the best. I see how it is. I see how it is. No more ramen for you. Never in your life will I make this at home. No.
gedi. I think the best thing to do actually is to get you guys to try both recipes and then vote on which one you'd like. So if you try both of them, leave a comment in the description boxes where you can find the recipes for both of these. And that's it. Thanks so much, guys. Awesome. Thanks, Abby. Yeah. <laughs> awesome Thanks, having you guys here. <laughs> well done. Congratulations. What are we starting out with? The 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 sauce. <laughs> the, the background. <laughs> I don't know what this. I don't know what this concoction is. Is it like a? Is it like a oh, sauce? I get it. So yeah. First, we're gonna make the sauce. Uh, or in a small bowl, we're gonna make the sauce. Just, just say that. You know, we're gonna first start with making this like sauce. Okay. Whatever okay. you want to call it. Sure, <laughs> sure, sure, sure. <laughs>